Iron is an allotrophic metal, which means it exists in more than one type of lattice structure. In normal room temperature, lattice arrangement of iron is BCC, whereas at 908 degrees centigrade, it changes to FCC gamma, and then at 1403 degrees centigrade, back to BCC again, and vice versa. Alpha iron is stable at lower temperatures and gamma iron is stable at higher temperatures. The x-axis represents the percentage composition of carbon in steel and the y-axis represents the temperature in degree centigrade. Pure iron melts at 1539 degrees centigrade. Cementite melts at 6.67% and carbon melts at 1550 degrees centigrade. The steel begins to solidify when it reaches a temperature corresponding to the line ACD. Steels containing less than 4.3% carbon start precipitating austenite crystals and at temperatures above 4.3 percentage precipitate cementite. Austenite is the solid solution of carbon in gamma iron. Steel solidifies at temperatures along the line AECF. Steels containing 0.8 percentage carbon and below solidify completely at temperatures corresponding to the AE line and consists of only austenite. Cast iron containing 2 to 4.3 percentage carbon solidifies at 1130 degrees centigrade. Austenite crystals precipitate simultaneously with cementite to form leadberite. These cast ions will consist of primary austenite and lead bright crystals. Cast iron containing 4.3 to 6.67 percentage carbon solidifies at 1130 degrees centigrade and consists of primary cementite crystals and lead bright. After this primary crystallization, all steels consist of austenite and all cast ions consist of cementite and leadberite. The secondary crystallization occurs in the solid state. The upper critical temperature line GS indicates the beginning of austenite decomposition and the precipitation of ferrite. The line SE indicates the temperatures at which austenite decomposes to form secondary cementite. Point S corresponding to 0.8 percentage shows the minimum temperature at which the austenite can exist in equilibrium condition. At point S, austenite decomposes to precipitate cementite and ferrite at the same time. This results in the formation of pearlite. At normal temperature, hypoeutectoid steel will consist of ferrite and pearlite. Hypoeutectoid steel will have a structure consisting of pearlite and excess cementite. On complete cooling, hypoeutectic cast iron will have pearlite, leadberite, and secondary cementite. Hypoeutectic cast iron will consist of leadberite and primary cementite. 